Hey everyone, just want to show you a project that I've been working on. Uh, over Memorial Day weekend, my family and I went to the river and took the boat out. The boat engine started overheating and I suspect that there's a problem with an ignition system. Uh, but to, or, in order to properly troubleshoot it, I have to have a direct voltage adapter or a peak voltage adapter. Well, they're 70 bucks and I'm kind of a cheapskate, so I went ahead and I bought the components that I needed to make one. Uh, what I have here is a uh, quarter watt resistor. It's a uh, one mega ohm, and I have a 450 volt capacitor rated at 22 microfarads. And moving over here, I have a 600 volt one amp diode to prevent back feeding from the circuit. Uh, what's going to happen is I have my mega ohm meter that I'm borrowing for my work hooked up here. It's on the 250 volt range. So when I hit the test button, I'm going to send 250 volts, which is actually closer to 276, uh, down these lines. It's going to go in to the capacitor and charge it up. When it charges it up, it's going to discharge out through my meter leads and run into the fluke that I've also borrowed from my work. And we should see about 267 volts building up to verify that this does work as a direct voltage adapter. So here we go. About 250 volts, capacitor's charging up pretty quickly. Okay, we're seeing about 273. About 273 is our peak voltage coming out of the capacitor. So, let go of the test button. That resistor is gonna bleed the circuit down so we don't zap ourselves with the capacitor. I'm gonna come over here, I'm gonna disconnect these leads, and I wanna hook these up to the meter and show you guys that uh, we are putting out that voltage from that mega ohm meter so let me set this up here and these white wires that you see coming out of the terminal strips they're just jumpers for the terminals so let me go ahead and get this set up for a test. There we go, that should hold. And come over here, hit the test button. Okay, let me wiggle this around real fast. Okay. One second. It's kind of hard to do with one hand. Okay, gonna have to set this down. Okay, here we go. Coming straight out of our mega ohm meter. There we go, 276 volts. So as you can see, we're about three volts off, which is no big deal. So, okay, well, thank you guys. If uh, anybody wants to see the schematic, just send me a message and I'll get it to you. Uh, this is going to be really good for troubleshooting things like uh, car ignitions, boat ignitions, anything that has a uh, rapid fire voltage that you can't really catch the peak without a DVA adapter for. It's going to go ahead and allow you to capture that voltage as the peak. So, I hope that helps people.